What's up everybody? Oh my gosh, if anything could go wrong with a video, it went wrong with this one, including my camera dying twice. My iMac has been giving me issues. Anyways, I am doing this makeup look today, which is like a halo kind of a cut crease, as you can see. I do have two options of lip. I prefer this one, but I do show you what it looks like using Rebel by MAC, which is a very, very dark. I hope this is the color I told Reese to do. By the way, this is a collaboration with my beautiful friend, Reese Babe, Reese MUA on YouTube. She is amazing. I have known, God, Reese, how long have I known you? I have known Reese now since I think 2011. It's been forever, okay? And we actually finally got to meet at Gen Beauty in 2016, which I have a picture up right now that you guys are seeing. And she's amazing. She's such an amazing person. She has such a kind heart. She has some skills. She's a professional makeup artist like myself. She is just amazing. And I totally connect with her on so many levels <laughs> and we are friends on Instagram. So after you are done watching my makeup tutorial, if you will please go over and support Risa, subscribe to her channel, watch her video, like her video. And now let's get started. All right, let's get started with Eden in the crease. You guys, I, I totally forgot to film this, but I also put Amber in the crease as well. And then I took um, Amber, which you will see right there, and I put it in the inner and outer corner of my eyeballs. My husband is asleep right now, and I feel so bad because I am super, super loud. Then I took Oud, and I also put that in the inner and outer corner of my eyeballs just to deepen it up. And then I also put a little bit into the crease just to give it a little more definition. Now I am taking Tarte Shape Tape and this is in the shade Light Medium Honey and I am carving out my crease to do a halo cut crease. I didn't show you guys, but I after I did that, I took the shade Neferit, Neferit Titty? I, oh God, that sounded so awful. <laughs> and I put that over my halo cut crease. I do not know how to say that. It's in the Desert Dust palette by Huda Beauty, which is what I'm using today. Then I'm taking the Heavy Metal Glitter Liner from Urban Decay in Midnight Cowboy, and this is going to sharpen your halo cut crease. I, I love, I love the Heavy Metal Glitters. They are just freaking amazing. Get your hands on it. Then I put on Queen Bee, which is what I already had on my eyeball, by the way, yeah. I already did one eye to make it easier, and now I'm just doing what I did on the top of my eye, on the bottom. Then I'm using Marc Jacobs, it's a brown liner. I'm doing my waterline, top and bottom. As you can see, oh my god, I'm so tired, you guys. Then Superhero Mascara from Make Cosmetics is bomb for bottom lashes because mine are pretty much non-existent. This is amazing, hands down. Estee Lauder Double Wear in the shade Tawny. Oh, this is my jam. It is my favorite foundation of life. Like, I always go back to it, you guys. I am not even joking. I don't know, can you guys hear me clicking my mouse? Oh well. It is so late, and this is real life, and I'm tired, and everybody's asleep in my house. So I'm just blending, 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 blah, blah, blah. And then I am taking the Tarte Shape Tape once again. This one is in light medium. It's a little bit darker. It's going under my eyeballs to cover my dark circles, because I'm tired. It's life. I have kids. Oh my gosh. Yeah. You, if you have kids, you know. Then I'm taking the Peach Perfect Palette, Palette, Peach Perfect Powder, and I am setting my makeup with that. And then I'm going under the eye with the same powder. I do not like to bake because it makes me look like I am a million years old and emphasizes wrinkles, so I'm doing that lightly. Then I'm taking the Wet n Wild Contouring Palette. This is amazing. This powder, oh my gosh, it blends. So, so good, you guys. So I'm just contouring my cheeks. And then I am going to contour my five head or my forehead <laughs> to try to make it look smaller. And then also my jawline. And I, I don't want a double chin. So I am also contouring in that area too. Then I'm taking the James Charles palette because they say you can use this on the face. So I'm going to use this really pretty cinnamon color I don't know what it's called because I don't have the shade names in front of me and it is pigmented. Look at how much blush went on my face. 
Oh no, so I got my MAC powder in medium plus the skin finish and I am kind of taming that bad boy down because I look crazy. And I'm taking Fuego by Dose of Colors, Desi X Katie. Oh, look at that. Look at that glow, you guys. I, I, I am obsessed with this one and Mirame. Mirame is my favorite, but I love this too. Taking down my nose. Oh my gosh. I think I'm gonna be out of breath. Holy moly. Doing the tip of my nose just a little. I don't wanna look like Rudolph with a glow. Then I'm taking Night Moth Lip Liner. I thought I put that in there. It's by MAC. I'm lining my lips because I'm gonna be using Rebel Lipstick by MAC. I don't know if that's the shade me and Reese agreed on doing because we used the same eyeshadow palette, same lipstick. I think I got the wrong one. You're gonna see what it looks like. And now. Nope. Oh, still lining. Sorry, guys. <laughs> now. I personally did not like the darker lip. So I changed it. I used Mannequin by Jeffree Star. I love it. Ooh, my favorite. And this is the final look. I hope you guys love it. Enjoy this video. I know I'm a little bit crazy and funny and I'm tired, but thank you guys so much for watching. Go check out Risa's video next and I'll see you guys later. Bye.